In 1940, Britain stood alone. The Nazi war machine had blitzed through Poland and crushed France in just six weeks. Now Hitler's eyes turned toward the English Channel. Operation Sea Lion, the planned invasion of Britain, depended on one thing, control of the skies. And so began the Blitz. The Luftwaffe, under Hermann Goering, launched nightly bombing raids over London and southern England. From September 7th to May of 1941, 57 consecutive nights of terror. Civilians fled to shelters, cities burned, Britain braced for invasion, but just beneath the chaos, a quiet defense was watching. It didn't fire bullets at the enemy. It didn't drop bombs on their position. It just listened. Radar, brand new and barely tested. The system was known as Chain Home, the world's first integrated early warning radar network. Conceived by Robert Watson Watt, it lined the southeastern coast of Britain, its towers standing silent watch. For the first time in military history, Defenders could see the enemy before the enemy saw them. These towers picked up Luftwaffe formations as far as 120 miles away, long before they reached the channel. The RAF, Royal Air Force, scrambled its Hawker Hurricanes and Supermarine Spitfires with surgical precision. Too fast, too high, too accurate. The German pilots were stunned. How did the British know? It wasn't luck, it was the information. Radar turned awareness into survival. Air Chief Marshal Hugh Dowding, commander of RAF Fighter Command, integrated radar data with ground observers and radio communications, creating what we now call modern command and control warfare. By October, the Battle of Britain reached a turning point. The Luftwaffe couldn't sustain its losses. Hitler postponed the invasion indefinitely. Britain was never invaded. Winston Churchill said, never in the field of human conflict was so much owed by so many to so few. He meant the pilots. But behind every Spitfire was a network of engineers, radar operators, mathematicians, many of them women working at places like Bordsey Manor and Bentley Priory. Their work didn't just win battles, it transformed warfare from radar to satellites, sonar to AI, Victory in modern war is no longer just about tanks or firepower. It's about information. Drop a comment if you believe radar saved the British from the Nazi invasion. Like this video and subscribe for more real stories from the lost and found, where quiet inventions can echo louder than bombs.